Mm-hmm. Yeah. Then my crush ni ni munga Eve. <laughs> Bro, munga Eve manze yani ni ultra woman. Mm-hmm. Una get like yani sita kitu mapenzi manze yani yeah. ni kitu kingine ngumu sana. So yani mimi nimeputia I've been like nimekuwa na depression for the last three months manze. Kufika kejani manze napata ma mandula zimeachwa hapo hivyo nje. So nikashanga ai mimi ama ni na afu mlango imefungwa. Una get mtu anafungwa ni demo wangu na get so ah uh, apo right next <laughs> naona ni mjama fulani hapo hivyo ametoa so mimi nilianza kuchana ka joki ka jeshi komando bunduki na koki hata kama wanibana marapa sichoki sitoki mimi kila msodoki god damn feel like afana lipak in the zone if you wanted to get it then i be happy to show we be cracking the code with the broken sack is the o to the g with the capital o. Eleo nangu nguvu nangu badi watu ambao unajua kazi nafanya amazing zaidi mazina shukuru sana kwa support yenu bana bila yinya ise singekuwa nimefika 24000 subscribers kitu ambacho mazee najifunia zaidi mnajifanya naona nina familia nzuri zaidi alafu mnanifanya na jinsi mtamu <laughs> anyway leo nilikuwa mshikaji fulani ambaye mimi mtu mbadi sana najua watu wengi sana wanamjua pale nje na kwa wale ambao wachache bado hawajamjua itakuwa fadhali zaidi kwa faida yenu pia e, mjue zaidi na angalau tupige story moja mbili tatu ukoje brother man Niko freshi barida. Uko guda guda? <laughs> Niko guda guda sio. Uko shega? Shega kabisa zote zote yani. Uko welo welo? Zote yani. <laughs> <laughs> Vile na fabro. Sa ebu ebu waambie wewe ni nani unafanya kitu gani angalau? Kwa wale kwa faida ya wale watu ambao labda wakujui. Yo so mazi kwa wasi wana nitambui. Mimi najitaga Tiboji T I B O Y. Ya najitaga Tiboji on all social media platforms. Mazi ukinitaka kunipata na jitagati boy kwa kila place so mimi na jitagati boy nafanya hip hop music na i can sing naweza fanya vitu mingi wallahi but basically mimi ni msanii okay so umezungumzia wewe ni msanii bro hebu kionjo kidogo wasije kusema ah huyu jamani ni msanii wa aina gani bwana so lazima ukapata yani kionjo flani vya main zaidi aina shida manzi unajua sisi we are born ready mm-hmm. and kama ni freestyle tunapiga hapo hapo sio right away so mimi nilianza kuchana ka joki ka jeshi komando bunduki na koki hata kama wanibana marapa sichoki sitoki mimi kila msodoki nina dream ya kuvaa tu masuti na buti moja kubwa ya kusiti manoti kwa koti leo nimekuja kuwapigisha magoti marapa basi hivyo ndo napitisha ripoti kwa vile vera sidika na walamba makoki kwa toja napenda sama kule jusipendi vioja eh hey bro kama <laughs> kama vile vera sidika anawalamba hey, anawalamba magoti kwa Ebu mm, sijali. Kabila <laughs> 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 vera sidika na wala mama koki kwa toja napenda sana. Eh so ana wala mama koki kwa toja. So una maanishaje bro? Hiyo <laughs> hiyo hiyo lazima wanze usome dictionary and understand. <laughs> <laughs> anyway so bro. Yeah. So, te, so labda ulianza mziki lini bro kwa ulianza mziki lini? Um I think uh, si 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 sema nilianza mziki lini let's say nilianza kupenda mziki lini ama nilianza mziki lini labda ulianza kuimba nini nini? Oh So nimependa muziki kutoka kitambo but nilianza ku compose and doing my own music after nimemaliza form 4. Mecheki. Mm-hmm. Yeah but in kwa high school I used to sing other people's songs and stuff. Yeah. Basically naweza sema nilianza kuimba when I was in first year. Yeah. Okay so umezungumzia mm-hmm. first year first year ni mwaka gani kwa wale watu ambao labda wanataka kujua the specific uh-huh. day uh, the specific year yenye ulianza kuimba. First year siko iko kitambo 2018. Oh kama sio kitambo bro. <laughs> Ndio vizuri bro. So umesema e, ulianza kuimba huo mwaka. Ni lini ulijua una talanta sasa? Um nilijua niko na talanta back then when I was in high school wakati ninge rap ngoma za wasi alafu watu wana feel like okay it was kind of impersonating lakini ilikuwa na rap niki rap ngoma ya msi inatoka fiti mm-hmm. like wasi wana nichape hey, manzi you get manzi una weza una check ile motivation ya yeah. ukupea ukiwa high school. Mm-hmm so you design do ngefanyanga but nikakuja nika notice manzi i still can do my own thing unaona yeah. after nilimaliza for this when i was uh, free ningekuwa na time yangu unajua so hapo ndo nikaanza ku maneuver and stuff here and then sound nikajua can compose my own my own stuff yani na ikakaa tu fit yani kabisa Okay bro ni si mara yako ya kwanza kar- si mara moja tu Kariga <coughs> Jones amekuposta amekuposta zaidi ya mara tatu bro alafu kuna ile song ambayo ulifanya na challenge ambayo inaitwa Yes Bana Yes Bana ile trend sana pale wakafanya challenge watu wengi lakini yani Kariga Jones alikuchagua wewe kukupost e, clip yako so how was the feeling Mzee feeling ilikuwa yani amazing sana na nashukuru tu Mungu for that kwa sababu mzee Ojin unajua Ojin ni Oji si ndio yeah. Ojin msempig yani Oji ame put 
Kenyan hip hop yani to the ends to the essence you know check it yani ame carry the Kenyan hip hop industry let's say so so yani um say akini post maze yani ni privilege kubwa sana alafu i appreciated yani nili appreciate too sana tu Yeah. yeah. So obro mesema uli appreciate sana. Na pia kuna kile kuna ile song ambayo inaitwa Wavy ile walifanya na Sakodi. Kuna tetezi kuwa wewe ndio mtu ambaye alimwandikia wimbo hivi kweli because hiyo ni kitu ambacho lab watu wengi sana walikizungumzia. Uh, I think kwa si ubonga sana and uh, story ni mingi zinaongelea alafu kuna ukweli na kuna uongo sana ndio. So basically tulifanya challenge and yeah ilikuwa tu amazing cause me I'm, I'm a number one from fan of uh, Calligraph John so yani ya yeah, kitoa kitu yani inapiga tu ma challenge you know yeah. yani vile tu nili rap almost the same vile na rap so wasi wakadani like i was jua wasi wa kenya si unawajua vile wanabonga yeah. yeah man hebu warapie kidogo ngala wajua <coughs> eh, even kweli ama una unasema tu <coughs> yeah so ilikuwa <coughs> Yo, God damn, feel like I finally back in the zone If you wanted to get it, then I'd be happy to show We be cracking the core with the broken sack Is the O to the G with the capital O Oh shit, but I pull up a chapter and go ham We part in the party, sap is part of the program They tell me they're ready to chop and you can send the fifth in my city But you niggas are ready for the cold name Finna fuck this game up <laughs> No, my son, bro You need a tardy son, I'm a zemi kubali son So, I'm going to bro You know, you're going to be music I'm going to be a bunch of love that I'm going to be a bunch of love I'm going to be a bunch of love I'm going Uh, basically challenges ni kibao alafu unajua Kenya mazee like <coughs> wana sema ngabila connection mazee ni kuwa yani ni kuwagwa yani si unajua so uh, i think basically kitu inalifanya na slack and kiasi ni financial uh in capabilities una check so um do alafu pia kutopea ile platform una check pia kuna zinachangia alafu pia nimekuwa nikisoma the same time so nimekuwa tu mambo ni mengi yani masando machat <laughs> <laughs> okay so yeah. kuna watu wengi sana wanakufananisha na Calligraph Jones na Katapila so watu wakikufananisha hivyo vile unaimba nini nini what is your take ah uh, unajua msia kinifananisha na msemo ngori yani ni kitu amazing una check yeah. alafu mtu atakisema tu una rap kama yeye ina maanisha you are doing something dope cuz uh, wasana kufananisha noni wasi wa sharp pop Shona. Yeah. So yani mimi take it positively. Alafu maybe hata mtu akisema it's due to una copy ni 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 ni. Mambo ni mingi. Watu watabonga. Ni mchache. Ni <laughs> mchache. Alafu you'll remain to be the same same yeah. person. So yani we see change. Yeah. Yeah. Okay bro, so unajua tumezungumzia changamoto, labda kuna zile achievements bado ambazo labda umeachieve unasema we, maze hapa sehemu ambayo nimefika na hiki kitu ambacho nimekifanya kwa kweli nimepiga tu. Ni kitu gani hicho bro? Ah, uh, kitu nimepiga tu anaweza sema ni kwamba Uh, yani nimeanza nimeanza ku, kuimba in a new way like okay it's it's almost the same vile wasio mko kirap but i'm bringing a new version of hip hop in in Kenya and, and at the same time in the whole industry because i can sing too una check my me mazeni yani ni ni got so versatile like i can sing and rap at the same damn time so i need think progressing in the same juice say ndo nimeanza like basically in the same like what i'm going to bring on the on the table ndo yani kitu cha kwa amazing like i think you know kitu yenyewe naweza sema ni progress nimepiga because that's what i'm working on and soon by the entire and release my new album yeah itakuwa crazy yani itakuwa amazing i've been working on it so yani my fans mazee out there mazee ngoja vitu kali zina come through okay so bro umesema umesukumzia album so labda ni mtu gani ambaye umemficha pale ndani ah uh, sin kibao kuna um, kuna mse wangu ana ni murangu sana kutoka kitamu ni anajita John Cena Silva. Yeah. Yeah, nimemficha kwa ngoma yangu. Kuna ngoma moja tumefanya nayo. Pia uh, kuna magai fulani uh, kutoka Costo tumefanya naye anaitwa Cristo Catel. Wase ni kibao yani, una check. Yeah. Eh, yani wase ni wengi. Yeah. Okay, so labda umezungumzia John Cena Silva, umezungumzia Cristo Catel. Na ni msani mwingine mkubwa zaidi ambaye labda unaweza sema yuko kwenye halba. Ah, uh, wase unajua uh, wase ni Kenya sometimes wana wana flows. Ala flows na manishaje uh, like wengine uringa mm-hmm. una check unaweza ambia we want to do some shit here unajua mm-hmm. talent as much as tunafaa tu ke uh, pesa pia ndani tunafaa pia to focus on talent yeah. you know uh, ni vile sasa unapata Kenyan artists pia wako money oriented in a such in a sense that they cannot give you an opportunity kufanya ngoma na wao just because like maybe uko down they don't look at the talent wanaangalia tu do Yeah. Okay I'm not talking about every every artist in Kenya because you see what they unaona yeah. yeah but wale wachache wenye nime 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 call upon then wakani turn down 
shout out to them manzi na respect sana <laughs> everyone respect is zaidi bro yeah. so unajua mimi ni swali fulani ambalo kila siku naulizia mtu ambaye amekuja kwenye show yangu na bado ni msanii hivi kweli bado bro uko single ama uko kwenye mahusiano <laughs> Usali buda ni ngumu zio eh siulize tu swali nyingine. <laughs> okay, hilo ni swali ambalo mimi napenda sana kuulizia msanii yote ambaye amekuja kwenye channel yangu kwenye hii platform ambayo nimempa mwenyewe na pia yeye pia amenipa kitu kizuri kufanya shughuli kama hii. So, eh hebu sema bro. Um, you know, uh, uh, mapenzi it's something that one should keep clandestine. But uh, just because we raise up so I think I can just Naweza sema tu niko single sasa hivi. Bro, kuko single kwa nini bro? Eh ni mtana shati mtoto mzuri, kwanza unavyovaa vizuri, kila kitu kinaendana vizuri. So kitu gani ambacho bro kinakusukuma una kwa single? Ah, uh, mzee mzee ma, love mzee ni kitu ngumu sana. Mm-hmm. Na ukiniona saina na kiti hapa alafu na nasema that like yani sita kitu mapenzi mzee yani yeah. ni kitu kingine ngumu sana. So yani mimi nimepitia I've been like nimekuwa na depression for the last three months manzi pole bro yeah so mapenzi yani amenipa trouble sana i, th- I think hadi nilifanya hadi i almost gave up in music cuz yani nilikuwa naona like hakuna haja yani unaona ushe give up in life buda bro ni kujikaza tu mambo ni mengi muda ndo mchache ilikuwa tragic vibaya sana mm-hmm. and uh, yani hata sitaka nikuongelea cuz nina nikumbusha yani hiyo stuff yani Want pole bro pole. lakini kwa faida ya mashabiki mashabiki zako na yule mtu ambaye anataka kukufuatilia sasa hivi na labda anakufuatilia zaidi so hebu waambie ni kitu gani ambacho labda kilikufanya hadi una feel like ah, mimi na mahusiano sitaki ah uh, okay <sighs> wow bro okay ah uh, there was this girl nilikuwa na date hapo hivyo tukiwa back in high uh, in campus mode mm, manzi nilikuwa nampenda sana yani tulikuwa tunapendana let, let me see so cause but then yeah vitu zilikuwa tu ziko sawa nini nini but it came a point uh, vitu zikaanza kukaenda ya mrama kiplani so tukaanza kukana misunderstanding yeah. no no so like kwa kila conversation tulikuwa tunapata yani like tunagombana atuko in good terms like yani akibonga aki eniko eniko c ona like katu ndani kabisa kitu kingine ambacho labda kilikuwa nafanya mwe ndani first thing ilikuwa nile like unapata unajua mimi nimse na hustle una get yeah. na at some point unajua hizi hizi kula mapenzi you have to hustle you cannot say that you're staying in the house making love without money that's like you're lying to yourself bro so ni ilikuwa tu hivyo like angishi na sema sina time ya can stuff like mambo bro ni mingi yani yani drama tu zikaanza kibao so mpaka nikaanza kujiuliza sasa madem wanatakaje yani you know yeah. uh, so stuck ni bonge sana i just don't want to talk about more but let me just go straight to the points ndio yeah. so i mean day flani hapo hivyo nimetoka gig yangu nimetoka haso zangu yani nini nini unajua mimi ni mpambanaji vibaya sana yeah man so uh, nimetoka tu haso zangu hapo hivyo nimefika kejani kufika kejani mzee napata ma mandula zimeachwa hapo hivyo nje so nikashanga ai mbibi ama ni na afu mlango imefungwa umeget so uh, so mimi nika na stuck ningie kwangu like like vile nimezoea unajua mimi nimse nimezoea nikiingia kwangu na ingia tu si lazima ni bisho hizi bisha kwako so mimi had to knock this time nika knock mimi ku knock ai like siski mtu akifungua had to knock once again ku juu kwa mlango hakuna like kuna padlock or anything like ina maanisha kuna mtu amefunga na ndani umeona until nil knock like four times ndo nikao na mtu anakuja akafungua mtu anafungua ni demo wangu na get so ah uh, apo right next <laughs> naona ni mjama fulani hapo hivyo ametoa ametoa shati bro nikashanga kwani alikuwa anapiga gym nini ametoa shati yako like ametoa shati like unaona skin sasa Bro mazin kashanga what's happening sasa nikauliza ude mwangu like what's up man like hata kama ni kufanya hizi mastingozi ungefanya nje hata mimi kwa lodging ama please hata kani disrespect what like ini nini manzi yani ushe ushe ika nikaumelewa ina position ni nikaumelewa bro yeah bro 
yani nilishindwa tu yani nibonge nini bro alafu msi yani anaka ana behave as like ni kama kuna kitu ime happen yani hata ana tension ametulia man alafu nikimwambia nikiuliza ude mwangu like what's not happening like what's this alafu anashinda na bonga like kuna unaona ni nini bro uni de mwangu mmempata kwa keja na boy mwingine alafu unamuuliza what's not happening like nini mbaya what's what's happening ana alafu nakuuliza like wewe unaona ni nini na happen bro mimi sim sim sana napenda ku cause drama or anything yeah. so niliamua ni ni toke tu ya new design like ni toke hapo but sijui nini li hani happenia wala so i had to push this girl cuz alikuwa ameni boy yani nikam push tu iwe so um jamaa mwenye ameka hapo hivyo kwa hiyo kwa hiyo sijui kwa bed hapo hivyo kwa bed bed yangu bro ni kwangu i'm talking about my house alafu ana come ana come sasa anataka like she's defending now my girl it's as anaka ndia na defend cuz tu nilim push huko jana amenishika shati bro unaona ameni ameanza kunipiga mabari bana ameanza kunipiga mabari seriously hata hapo hivi i think nikikuonyesha hapo i think sijui kama unaweza una mark fulani hapo hivi unaona yeah. yeah so hizo ni mabari bro niligongwa bro serious na siku chochi bro nikagongwa mabari so i had to take an, uh, a step uh, like like ni, lazima ningemfanya kitu manzi kwa sababu uweze nipiga kwangu unaona yeah. si kufanya ni drama si kugusa mtu yote unaona nikatoka hapo hivyo nikatoka nikaenda nika report nika nikiwa ob uko report wapi yeah, siko police station hapo hivyo California oh, okay. yeah so nikaenda nika report nikaambia what happened nini 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 nikapewa like nikaandikisha nika nikaandikisha kesi unaona ah uh, matters was Udi mwangu pia ameenda sasa ku report pia. Na vitu vile zimeanza ku change sasa. Ameenda ku report that nilikuwa like I was raping her. Hey, pole bro. Bro hata ukiniambia mapenzi sasa hivi bro ninakuambia wala sitaki. So mi manze sasa nikashanga like udi mwanatakaje. Unaona sasa zimekuwa ni cases mbili. So I had to do this. Huh? I went there and with the drama case cuz siko nataka drama mingi nikana nika with drama my case nikasema acha tuikae acha ufanye vile wanafanya the next morning tu niko kwa bestangu mazi mnapigiwa simu naitajika police station oh get ah nikasema siendi walai that's bullshit so miss you are in trisage walai nikichill tu tunapiga happy na 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 boy wangu fulani huko mtaani na kujiwa tu na ma, na masanse bana. Masanse ni nini so bro? Okay na kujiwa tu na mapolisi. Mm-hmm. Ona nika mapingo hapo hivyo wananichukua kwenda police station like I've done something like what have I done man? At first I was resist but sasa they had to take me by by force. No. So bro to cut this long story mm-hmm. short. Yes. So mm-hmm. alipokuchukua polisi so what happened? So a uh, police aliponifikisha huko yeah. Udema akakam aka claim that I wanted to rape her then Udema kaulizo like by how chance like it happened even na even not get So unajona madimu ku ndani they are so favored manzi huko Kenya like I think he he shit in happening kila place na he fight na ina fight change too unaona I fight like tuna favor one gender tuki to to tuki tuki tukiegemea ama tukionele hii jenda ingine yes. no no so aka like aka kwa like uh, i wanted to rap hadi akaonyesha sijui ma max ma vitu mingi bro i just don't know yani ude mali change paka kaka msimunye sipo ifikiria wala eh no no so ah uh, mimi shit ka hapa sasa ikabidi i had to 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 go to the like kuna kuna jail fulani na kuanga huko inaitwa ah uh, zinitwanga kilifi prisons sasa hapo hivyo ndo nilichukuliwa bro nikalala for one day then sasa so, juu ilikuwa ni shit mbaya to call my family and stuff wakani bail out sasa nikatoka inje out of bond so bado kuna kesi ama kesi yeah, bado kesi iko lakini li, nika iliisha cuz like unajua kitu ya uongo maziwezi kuwa unashinda uki uki, uki nini tu unaona yeah. yeah nililipatu hiyo do yenye walihitaji nikatoka for that time but sidan kayo kesi bado inaendelea but i don't know vile kitu tu ina exist so in short uh, vile huyo demo ali, ali report aje yenda labda kufuatilia case so that's why maybe labda wale decide to withdraw the case i think um o demo no just uh, we don't talk by the way so no na so sijui like anafikiria nini like sijui what what is like sijui do 
mitu nilitoka tu we bro pole sana kwa hilo pia lakini changamoto yeah, zipo bro ni kawaida ya maisha since then manze bro ni kama manze mapenzi kama into 11 na nifikisha bro na sacrifice yani unapenda mtu mwenye anakufanya hizo disrespect zote na to make matters worse sana kufikisha that that position Wa wow, pole bro so ungekuuliza bro unajua labda sasa umesema utaki kwenye mouse kwa kwenye mahusiano kuna yule mtu ambaye labda una feel like akija kuja katika maisha yako eh, unaweza mpenda labda do you have a crush on somebody hey bro manzi sasa hii sidan can't appenda but okay crush ni unaweza kuwa nao but eh sema mbona mapenzi bro acha ni acha tu dude na mziki wallahi <laughs> so ebu ebu tuambie kama una crush na kwa mtu yote i Kenya I'm not only let it be let it not be in Kenya any place to Oh uh-huh. <laughs> Hey la monaik bana <laughs> Ni vizuri weka kila kitu wazi kama una crush Ah okay. uh, yangu ni, ni, ni different cause like hata mtu nime crush na mtu mmoja kwa ina relationship so sidani kai na waka utama unaweza sema tu Of course you can say Mhm yeah. Then my crush ni ni munga hivi <laughs> bro <laughs> hebu niambie ni kitu gani ambacho labda kinakufanya unampenda munga hivi ah munga hivi manzi yani ni ultra woman una get yani ni dem mwenye ni super woman wallahi like okay first thing unajua zitetea mtu bila reasons ndio first thing undem she so hard working yeah. and at least ame 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 ame, ame make hata wasi wengine wa content creators including yourself <laughs> ukaanza kufuata hiyo mkono at least you're interviewing yeah. us na, na ni fit by the way tuna appreciate yeah. sana you guys mazi mna tu una sana mazi at least mna mna tuleta to the platform hadi mafans wetu na to reach out so yani ni kitu amazing sana yeah. another thing that girl like she's so beautiful manzi na appreciate sana yani her beauty wonderful alafu like yani ni type ya dem mnaweza taka una get yani she's so pure like aku tu yani fine fine yeah so bro umesema munga if we mwenyewe bado unajua yuko kwenye mahusiano yeah the, yeah sasa ndo nilisema like ndo maana hata sikuwa najua kai hiyo crush inaweza kuwa in exist but that's what it is bro like all dem tu ndo naweza sema and crush yeah nani mwingine kasi like kasi yeah, there's nobody then so ni baki tu single na mziki wangu <laughs> so in short labda ukija kupata nafasi ya ku kumdate uteza mdate so na za podazi mchanzi akudate mtu akwe na relationship ina make sense kweli <laughs> <laughs> so yani in, in for example okay god forbid though ije kupata kuwa wameachana mpenzi wake ije kawa sasa wewe ndo unamhitaji na akupe nafasi what will you do okay i'm not praying for that to happen but uh, it happened yeah mimi naweza approach ni mwambie mazii you girl mazii una ni amel una ni chic una ni pop ni yani wala like una vile mimi na kupaja <laughs> yeah na it happened too yeah but unajua pia another thing ni kwamba uh, people fail to understand that unaweza penda mtu mwenye akupendi unajua love pia ni funny sana but yeah. as for me personally like yeye ndo mdem mwenye ananimaliza wala yeah so in any case maybe things he turn up ups and down naweza approach ni mwambie mazii ni mwambie like na mfeel yeah. and i want her and yenye takaa mtu ndo hiyo yenye like yenye tatokea ndo hiyo <laughs> sawa bro nimeshukuru sana kwa kupiga story na wewe so kama crush wako ni munga hivi safi tu unajua pia ni vizuri kwa kusema kile kitu ambacho kiko moyoni mwako hakuna mtu ambaye amekufosi pia wewe umesema kwa uzuri kuwa unajua yuko kwenye mahusiano so you can't force her to be to be yours in kweli yeah, true true yeah, yeah. Easy for, easy for. Yeah. Yeah. Meshukuru sana kwa kupiga story na wewe bro hebu waambie labda anaweza kupata sehemu gani kwenye mitandao ya kijamii uh, so mazi ma fans wangu out there mazi kitaka kunipata kwa haya Uh, ukunipata in any social media platforms youtube na jita gatiboy g a t i b o y uh, instagram gatiboy tiktok gatiboy facebook gatiboy like mimi na jita gatiboy tu kwa kila social media platforms yeah nashukuru sana bro kwa kupiga story na mimi kizo ambacho nimefurahia zaidi bro thank you so much mazena appreciate for the for the platform na appreciate for your time and may god bless you bro may god bless you too bro maze and nashukuru sana kwa support yenu na asante sana kwa kunipa sikio lako sikio lako pia na macho yako bwana eh, nimepiga na eh, story na mshikaji mbadi kabisa gatiboy maze fika kwenye channel yake as gatiboy maze gatiboy fika kule subscribe angalau pia pande zaidi maze bye bye till next time